to my channel. In today's recent haul, I have hauled four items that I really gravitated to because they are in line with what I love. I love my lace pieces from Misguided. For some reason, they do it for me. So I ordered this piece and this is a burgundy. Wow, it looks a little bit too big. But it's better big than too small. It, it looks a little bit too big and it's very ruby red and more towards the burgundy spectrum. On the spectrum of reds, it's more towards the burgundy color. So, very great piece. I can't wait till I get you on the floor, good looking. Uh, hey, going out so hot, just like you love it. And I don't want to burn myself, I just had to touch it. But it's so fine. Really love the long sleeves. I love laces with long sleeve. And it's all right, baby. And we don't mind all the watching. Hi. Cause if the study goes real close, they might learn something. She um, unfortunately, it's not a thong, but for me, I don't mind that at all. I don't mind that at all. Yes, it's a little too big. I don't like that. I think I must have um, somehow ordered the wrong size, but it's okay. I still love it. I hope it fits. And yeah, misguided guys. Maybe I was a tad bit misguided with this piece only because I think I bought it a little too big, but I still love it. Gorgeous, rich color. Beautiful piece. She ain't nothing but a little doozy when she does it. She's so fine tonight. It would look great on the the very same blazers that I just showed you. Sorry to interrupt guys, but just a quick note. Hi guys! If you just so happen to just click on my video, you are new, please click the red subscribe button. This is the red subscribe button right here. It's free. Next, you'll click the notification bell and you'll be notified whenever I upload a new video. Thank you guys so much and let's get to the video so yes guys now that we have gotten that out of the way the next piece is another lace piece and this time i think i got the right size It is a thong, so I can get away with wearing it on under my high-waisted 
pants without having any issues with lines so that's awesome and this piece is lined not lined which is a little bit disappointing but I can handle that I don't mind it at all it's it's okay I'm okay with it I've made my peace with it as soon as I saw it a little bit disappointed a little bit misguided but it's all good I'll show you how to deal with disappointments whenever you purchase items such as lace pieces that you did not expect to be online. As mentioned above, all I simply did was to add another sleeveless lace top underneath and voila! Yeah. But, yay! This is lined, it is great, I love the lace detail, I love the fact that it has these spaghetti straps that are adjustable and catch papers, get high, out Vegas, do say on doubles, ain't looking for trouble, you just got good jeans, so a nigga trying to cuff you. lace as well really love this piece I have been eyeing it for quite some time now and finally took the courage to buy it so I I do like it I do like it my next piece which I must admit is a little bit disappointing for me this is a piece that claims to be snake print when I ordered it I have a weakness for snake print as well I do love animal prints animal prints are often stereotyped and people who wear animal prints are sometimes stereotyped as well as belonging to a certain group or category of people that I would not mention because I don't think it's fair. I think animal prints are very flattering and very great pieces if you pair them well. This I'm not quite sure I would put it in the category as snake print because it has some other designs and patterns that are woven into the fabric that are not at all within the animal kingdom if you know what I mean they are more mathematically oriented with the more oval shaped pattern and so I don't see much snake going on here at all, to be honest, which is good for the snakes, actually. But it is described as snake print, and if you're expecting a total snake print, you would be totally disappointed, because it's not. But I love the fact that it's high-waisted. That's what attracted me. Shows. White shoes at the black shows. Green car for the Cuban links. Come sit back and enjoy the light show. Nothing exceeds like success. Style guy come from having the best of the best. Is this what it's all about? I'm at the rest. The front, my rent, disturbing the guests. Tears in distress. It has a wide waist band. Tears on the dress. Try to hide a face with some makeup sex. Uh. This is trouble season. Time for tuxedos for no reason. 
All saints for my angel. Alexander Wang too. Ass tight denim and some dunks. I show you how to do this, young. It's white leg. Trouble, you just got good jeans, so a nigga trying to cuff you. So, what I would say about this piece is that the it's very silky or satiny to the touch. So it's something that it's a great piece to wear in the summer months, on vacation. I'll show you what the fabric is. This is what it is. And sadly, it's 100% polyester. Whenever you see keep away from fire, guys, you know it's polyester, which I absolutely hate these pleated details in front here that I like as well but what I must add is that at times sometimes the pleated details on a pants could add a little bulk for me personally that's what I think it could appear a bit bulky so I tend to steer clear from items with pleated details they look so gorgeous though they absolutely do for those with a little bulge around your abdomen area beware of these type of style to me personally i think they add bulk <laughs> This is what it looks like. This is how I style it. shop in the petite section if you're less than five seven or eight please shop in the petite section because these are built for Amazon women really long and so yeah it can often drag on the floor but I love when my trousers sweep the floor like a gown, just the way a gown fits sweeping the floor, that's how I love my trousers, so I don't mind it at all. I'll just take up a few inches and I'm good to go. So I'm pairing it with my Rebecca Minkoff um, bag because I think that the burgundy adds a really nice contrast to the lace texture as well as the satiny texture of this trousers. 
love it. And I'm pairing it with my zebra stripe stiletto Palacio stiletto shoes. So these are my zebra shoes up close. I love, I just love pairing two different prints and the zebra stripes really complement this stripe as well and it adds a great contrast to both the snake print as well as this one. It's a really great date night look. Love it. And if you're saying that it's it's similar to these, of course it's similar, but it's not the same, it's different. See? Potato, potato, tomato, tomato. <laughs> so that's my haul, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you found it informative as well as inspirational because that's what I am here for. If you have any questions about the items in terms of um, fabrication and of the feel, comment below, I'll let you know. But this piece I might add is transparent. Like the Zara piece, I can see you guys a million miles away. <laughs> so this is a piece that is great for the beach. I bought it for the office. I don't think it's it's going to be going to the office with me anytime soon unless I get some really good underpants. That's the only how it's likely to go. Or unless I want to get fired. That's the only time it's going to be worn at the office. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Love you guys. Please don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.